I'm not good enough. I'm all alone. He hates me. I'm not smart enough. Self-doubt and self-talk, that inner critic. The good news is it's normal. You're human. We all have them. The bad news is it's holding you back from growing. It's holding you back from succeeding in what you want. It's holding you back from creating the life you desire. So I want to talk about the self-talk, the self-doubt, and exactly what you can do about it. I'm going to give you examples and it's going to be a nice video. I want you to stay until the end because I have a free gift at the end, some action that you have to take, but I'm also very happy that you found my channel, create the life you desire. That's what all my videos are about because I want to help you break free from that career or that nine to five or that situation that you're unhappy in so you can live the life and get the freedom that you desire and that you're meant to live and not the life you're expected to live for someone else. So let's dive right in. Self-talk and self, self-doubt. Let me give you some examples. Um, you go to the supermarket and you see your neighbor and he completely ignores you. Like he's walking by and completely ignores you. And you're thinking, oh my gosh, what did I do wrong? And what's, you know, what's wrong with me? And, 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 and he's, a, he's mad at me and I'm, 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 I mean, what's wrong with me? Or you have a date and he tells you or she tells you that he's going to call you and he never calls. Hmm. So you're thinking, oh no, it's a disaster and he didn't like me and I'm not good enough and I will be alone for the rest of my life. Or final example, your boss or your partner or something or somebody, you know, close to you says, um, let's meet tomorrow because I want to talk. And you're thinking, oh no, something bad happened. I did something wrong. <gasps> oh no, what's going to happen? Does that sound familiar? What is going on here? What is going on here is that you are putting these stories into your head because all of that are thoughts that are in your head it's stories that you're telling yourself and they're negative so i want you to watch the language those words that you put into your head are super important the language that you talk to yourself well that's why it's called self-talk but it makes you self-doubt because it's negative so what can you do about it number one catch them catch those words and most of the time it's very telegraphic speech oh no oh my always something is going wrong i'm never i should it's like all these short little sentences right those are the ones you have to catch then number two stop it drop it stop judging yourself you are judging yourself negatively you are making yourself the problem because the more you can catch yourself and find these, the more aware you are and the, the less they will happen because you're actually catching them and then stopping them and stop judging yourself and making yourself the problem because that's what's going on. I'm the problem here. Wait, wait, the next steps are super important. So keep watching. Number three, you can challenge them. Are those thoughts really true? Ask yourself, is this really true? Is it a fact that I'm going to be all alone for the rest of my life? Is it a fact that I'm not good enough? Is it true that I don't deserve this? Is it true? I don't think so. And then finally, number four, and this is super, super, super important. And the most important, separate yourself from it. See, here's the thing. You are making you the problem, but you are not the problem. You have to separate yourself. Instead of internalizing the problem, 
externalize it. So you are not, don't make yourself the problem. It's not because one date goes wrong that you are the problem. No, separate yourself from it. How can you do that? It's really, really important. You step away from it and you kind of, maybe an image helps. It always helps me. It's almost like you're taking it out of the box and then you observe it. Okay, what's going on? What is this thought? I'm not good enough. I'm alone. I'm going to be alone. I'm going to be single the rest of my life. So it's like you, you, you take it outside, you take it, you know, out of the box and you observe it and you look at it and you question it and you challenge it. And then you decide what you can do with it. I'm going to throw it away because it's absolutely ridiculous and it's not true. I'm going to put it in another box and deal with it later. Um, I'm, you know, I'm, you, you really analyze it and you decide what you're going to do with it. But the thing is that you have to separate yourself from it instead of internalizing everything that's happening in your life is not your fault. Everything that's happening in your life is not you. You are not the problem, but you're making yourself the problem because you're internalizing everything that's going on and you're creating these stories. So let's start reframing those stories. You go on a date and it's not a good date and he doesn't call you back. Are you going to tell yourself, I'm going to be alone the rest of my life and I'm never going to date again? Or are you saying, oh, you know what? He's not right for me and there's plenty of fish in the ocean, so I'm just going to find someone else. Different story, different feelings, different reactions. And hey, I feel so much better. I'm just going to go on another date and find another fish in the water. If your neighbor completely ignores you as you think he does, what about telling yourself, you know what? He's probably having a bad day. Not my problem. It's another story. And I feel so much better because it's not about me. It's his problem. He's having a bad day. It's not about me. If your partner or your boss says, oh, we have to talk. Oh my gosh, what's going to happen? Or the other story. Oh, cool. They're going to update me and what's going on in their lives and, and at work. And, and I'm looking forward to that because it's going to be a great conversation and I'm not aware of everything. And so I'm, I'm, I'm going to be updated and it's going to be nice. What story are you telling yourself? Every self-talk and self-doubt and all that inner critic, it's you telling you a story. So change the story because those limiting stories, they just, hold you back. They keep you stuck. By the way, if you're still very stuck and you want a free video training with seven steps to get you unstuck, get the link right below this video. Stay till the end because I have another free gift for you, but the link is right below. So I want you to be aware that the self-talk and the self-doubt, it's all because you're internalizing it. So overcome that by changing that story, right? And separate yourself from the problem. You are not the problem. It's time for you to give yourself more love. Tap yourself on the back. I'm okay. I'm good enough. Hey, and I had to learn all of this myself. So I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and so, yeah, I look myself in the mirror now and say, Hey, I'm okay. I'm all right. I love you, Rachel. <laughs> Why don't you try it? It may sound funny, but it works. Self-love is the solution. It's the answer. And you are not the problem. So, action for you. Comment below. Do you recognize any of this? Have you tried it? Tell me, tell me, tell me right below. And you can find free resources to get you unstuck right below this video. But the free gift I have for you is if you are really stuck and you want to discuss your situation and you want to break free from your career and your nine to five and start creating your own business and grow towards that, then let's hop on a call and I can help you to create clarity and a next step. And it's a free call you can get if you click the link right below. So enough for me. Um, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit that red little button right below. And I will see you in the next video because you are rocking it and you're growing and you're succeeding and you can do it. So I'll see you in the next video.